official foreclosure notice has been filed for Zora Bar and Rooftop after the owner failed to pay $3 million in debt. That's where we find our own Griffin right this morning at the bar located on the corner of MLK and Ingersoll Avenue. Griffin, what's the future like now for this building? Well, Justin, the future is really up in the air, but when it comes to the business owners along Ingersoll, they have high hopes for what could replace the bar, but whoever does take over will have to deal with the building's past baggage. The building got a negative reputation after a man was shot and killed here in last November. In the summer of 2023, there were more shots fired overnight. On top of that, the building debt, along with its interest, is just shy of three and a half million dollars, according to county records. The corner Zora is on is the entrance to the pedestrian friendly Ingersoll neighborhood from downtown Des Moines and the airport. If a successful business can set up shop and bring people in, business owners along Ingersoll could benefit. Well, that, that piece of property has always been important. So before Zora came in, you know, originally, I believe there was a pizza down there. Uh, there was an Irish bar for a long time that was quite popular. Uh, the Waverly moved in and then they just tore it all down and kind of started from scratch. But uh, definitely that's, that's a very, very important corner, very busy corner. Um, lots of traffic down there, a lot of pedestrians coming through there. So yes, I, I think it's gonna be very important in the future. Now the property is scheduled to be available for sale this October, but uh, we really don't have a great idea of when somebody may swoop in and buy the building. The foreclosure proceedings are taking place this month, uh, but really, you know, the people and business owners on Ingersoll are hoping that uh, somebody comes in and can turn this building around uh, because it's in a great location and can do a whole lot when it comes uh, towards kind of that entrance, at least from the MLK side into the Ingersoll neighborhood. Yeah, from the outside, definitely looks like a gem with the rooftop and uh, a lot of uh, outdoor space there. Thank you, Griffin Wright, giving us an update on the building and what it could become.